Hello everyone, my name is Faisal Nadeem and welcome to our another video on job interview training course. In this video, I will teach you how to prepare for a compliance interview. If you are applying for any compliance related role in any organization, make sure to stay tuned to this video because I promise to help you pass your interview at the first attempt. And to achieve this objective, I'm sharing with you the top most important compliance job interview questions along with their sample answers. I will also let you know the purpose of asking each question from the hiring manager so you can create your answer by including all those important things that I will teach you in this video. I have already uploaded a video on compliance officer job description that can also help you a lot in your interview preparation. The link is in the description of this video. Very quickly before we get started, if you are watching my video for the first time, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also ring the notification bell so you won't miss any of our upcoming career focus content. Alright, let's jump in. So the first important question that you should need to prepare for is, can you explain your understanding of regulatory compliance and its importance? Basically, the purpose of asking this particular question from your interviewer is that your interviewer wants to assess your basic knowledge of compliance principles. So how you can answer to this particular question is that, well, regulatory compliance refers to the adherence to laws, regulations, guidelines, and specifications. It's crucial for ensuring that the company operates ethically, avoid legal issues, and maintain its reputation. In our industry, compliance may involve adhering to financial regulations, data protection laws, and industry-specific standards to protect both the company and its stakeholders. Question number two. How do you stay updated with the latest regulatory changes and developments? Basically, the purpose of asking this particular question from your interviewer is that your interviewer wants to evaluate your approach to staying informed about regulatory changes and more importantly, they want to know your commitment to ongoing learning and compliance excellence, okay? So how you can answer to this particular question is that Well, I prioritize continuous education and subscribe to regulatory newsletters attend relevant seminars and conferences and actively participate in professional networks to stay updated on latest regulatory changes and developments. Additionally, I regularly review industry publications and regulatory updates issued by relevant authorities to ensure our company remains compliant and proactive in addressing any changes. Question number three. Describe a situation where you faced a compliance challenge in a previous role. How did you handle it? Basically, the purpose of asking this particular question from your interviewer is that your interviewer wants to assess your problem-solving skills and more importantly, your ability to navigate complex compliance issues and your approach to mitigating risk, okay? So how you can answer to this particular question is that Well, in my previous role, we encountered a situation where a new regulation was introduced that significantly impacted our operations. I conducted a thorough analysis of the regulation identified its implication on our processes and collaborated with cross-functional teams to develop a compliance strategy. This involved updating policies and procedures, conducting staff training, and implementing monitoring mechanism to ensure adherence. By proactively addressing the challenge, we successfully navigated the compliance requirements while minimizing disruptions to our business. Question number four. How do you prioritize compliance initiatives within a company, especially when faced with competing priorities? Basically, the purpose of asking this particular question from your interviewer is that your interviewer wants to evaluate your organizational and prioritization skills, as well as your ability to balance competing demands while maintaining compliance standards, okay? So how you can answer to this particular question is that, well, when prioritizing compliance initiatives, I first assess the potential risk and regulatory requirements associated with each initiative. I then prioritize based on factors such as legal obligations, potential impact on the company's reputation, and the degree of alignment with our strategic objectives. I believe in taking a risk-based approach, focusing on areas with the highest risk exposure while ensuring alignment with the company's overall goals. Question number five. How do you promote a culture of compliance within an organization? Basically, the purpose of asking this particular question from your interviewer is that your interviewer wants to examine your ability to foster a culture of compliance and more importantly, the importance of proactive engagement and employee awareness, okay? 
so how you can answer to this particular question is that well i believe that promoting a culture of compliance starts with leadership setting the tone from the top it's important to communicate the company's commitment to compliance provide adequate resources and training and lead by example i encourage open communication channels for employees to raise compliance concerns and provide regular education and awareness programs to reinforce the importance of compliance in everything we do recognizing and rewarding compliance efforts also helps to reinforce positive behavior and foster a culture where compliance is ingrained in our daily operations so there you have it five most important compliance interview questions and answers i have already uploaded a video on compliance officer job description that can also helps you a lot in your interview preparation The link is in the description of this video. Always remember that practice makes perfect, so take these answers as a starting point and tailor them to your own experiences and skills. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe our channel Knowledge Topper and also give us a thumbs up as well. You can also share it with anyone you think would benefit from it and don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions for future video topics. Thank you so much for joining me today and I will see you in the next video on knowledge topper until then keep striving for professional success have a good day